yourselves, first of all? Uh, my name is Tony Kay, XGF. I'm Joey yeah. Mullen. Hello. Tom Evans. See the camera? Richard oh, Bryans. Okay. Over there. Glenn Sherba. Okay, so we're all bad finger. Now, who, you're, the two of you are original members. Tom and I. Yeah. Tom and I. When was bad finger formed? About 1647. <laughs> <laughs> just, just after the war. <laughs> it was just a twinkle in his dad's eye. No, yeah. Uh, about 67. Now, uh, if I remember correctly, you were on uh, the Beatles label, Apple Records, and Paul McCartney basically kind of led you by the hand a bit. Would you say that? Okay. He was very nice and everything. And uh, why don't you tell him about that? I never held his hand at all. It's a total rumor. Total yeah. rumor. He wanted he him to. <laughs> he, he did want him to. He produced the first single that we had out, "Come and Get It," um, in 1970. And we had a soundtrack to a film called Magic Christian, which he produced also. And then we worked with a uh, uh, few <laughs> other Beatles, uh, except for uh, John. John, and you worked with... Yeah, yeah we, we did a, a tr couple of tracks on the Imagine album. Uh, that was uh, fun. Yeah, we did, yeah. Mm. You can imagine that. <laughs> did it, were you, you were very heavily influenced then by the Beatles? No more than anybody else. No more than anybody else. I'd have to say that they were obviously they were obviously great and everything. But uh, you know, we they were inf we were influenced by the same people they were influenced by. You know, um, you know in Liverpool, Buddy Holly and Chuck Berry and all of the kind of blues records. A lot of American singers we used to get them in the record stores in England in Liverpool. What you did with Yes, how has that contributed to what you're doing here? Not a lot. Nothing to do Absolutely <laughs> nothing to do with it. Okay. No, I, was, um, I wasn't very interested in their music right from the start. In fact, oh. uh, it was, uh, wasn't really one. I was, I was basically played with rock and roll bands before that. And uh, no. since then, I played with David Bowie, which who was more into rock and roll than, a, than a Badfinger came up. And it was exactly what I wanted. So. Out of shape. <laughs> so what are some what are some of the things that you guys are going to be doing now that you're I think I'll go on to, <laughs> back together because at one point yeah. you you had broken up and gotten back together and now we're going strong now uh -huh. okay yeah. what That's is going to be happening with you um, a new album very soon we're going to start rehearsing and uh, we'll probably start recording in uh, June or July maybe we should go um, and do a, a tour to promote the album if if the, the right tour comes along.
Old honky-tonk rock and roll.